my syringes, everything. I'd throw them in the alley, I'd throw them in the trash, and I'd say, I'm done, I'm gonna quit. Day later, I'd be crawling in the dumpster, pulling the paraphernalia back out. I graduated in 1966. In 65, uh, I started smoking weed. Not a lot of people were smoking weed. In the LA area, there's lots of good bands. I, like I was, you know, I, I did have fun in my teenage years. There was the people that drank a lot, there was people that smoked weed a lot, and there was people that did heroin. And I did all of those things. I went to prison for a little while. I went to a, uh, a, a, pres a rehab prison in California. I kind of involved in smuggling and drug sales. But when I got out of the federal system, they suggested firmly that I go to treatment. They sent me to treatment in 1991, a place called uh, Impact Treatment Center in Pasadena, California. And I was introduced to Narcotics Anonymous there, and um, I haven't looked back since. I was 41 years old. I didn't know what I was gonna do after I got out. So I was in a treatment center for seven months, and Impact asked me if I'd like to stay on, uh, on the treatment center as uh, pro staff. I met a guy that helped me through. Even when I got out of treatment, he was there for me. I still check in with him once a year now. He's got about 40 years clean. I accepted my fault, my part, and everything, how my life was. Treatment saved my life. My mother was so happy to see me get clean, and she, she died, uh, saw me clean. My father died early. He never got to see me get clean. I talked to a friend of mine named Charles Anderson and we put together a plan to open Recovery in Motion. Opened the doors in April of 2015. Our addicts today are starting out at 11, 12 years old. I, I get kids in here 20, 21 years old and I'll tell you, they've been down a road already at 21. When our clients come to Recovery in Motion, they are pretty broken. They can barely even keep their head up. Usually people that drink, they're getting DUIs. A lot of people come here, have cases. You won't have to be in front of the judge anymore. You don't have to be under a probation officer. We shoot a picture when they come in. We shoot their picture and when we leave, we put it in their certificate when they graduate. Here's how you look when you came in. Here's how you look now. Which way do you want to look? <laughs> well, our goal here is to make them well and make them productive members of society. That's the key, is just staying clean. Detox to Rehab wants to help as many people as possible and do it the right way. Please subscribe, comment, and like our channel. Thank you for watching.